Okay, this question states, find the definite indefinite integral of x times square root of x squared plus 1 dx. So first, write down the problem. First, we have to find u and our du's. So to find the u, you take the biggest part or the stuff that has most stuff in the equation or something that's under square root or that's being squared. So since there's a square root here, we're going to take x squared plus 1 as our u. So you take the derivative of this, which is du. So that will be 2x. And then don't forget dx. And then since we want x dx by itself, since that's all we have left, since we already got this, we want x dx. So all we need is we got to move the 2 to the other side. So we divide it to over here. So that turned out to be 1 half du equals x dx. Next, we are going to change the equation to put u in. So first you put our number out of the way in front of it. Integral and then square root since that's what's u. And you put square root of u du. Next. You're going to want to take the antiderivative of this. So you keep the 1 half. And we're just going to change this to 1 half du. So it's easier to take the antiderivative. So 1 half times u to the 3 halves. And by doing that is you increase the 1 half by 1. And then you divide that number. So as you can see here, I took, brought it to the 3 halves and then divided by 3 halves. And then don't forget to add our constant. Now we just need to do algebra and get rid of all the extra numbers. So it would be 1 half times 2 over 3, since this would have to be multiplied by that, so you flip it over. So those two are being multiplied, u to the 3 halves plus c. Since the 2's cancel, it would be 1 third u. But now we can bring in our u, which oh, up here we stated that u was x squared plus 1. So x squared plus 1 to the 3 halves, like up here, plus c. So that is our final answer. 1 third times x squared plus 1 to the 3 halves plus c.